Uh, let's see, I've dated a lot of different types of dudes. Had a lot of different kinds of the sex. <laughs> you may not believe it with this hair, but it's real. I have, I dated a lot of different, I've been like exploring the types of man. Thinking maybe what, like I'll weed my way through all the types and find the one that works for me. Like uh, some of the types I dated, I dated uh, dudes, actual just dudes, you know what I mean? Like bro dudes for like a little while there. I was living in LA actually and I dated this dude. He was a super dude dude. He was very like just a baseball cap wearing cigarette smoking from Kentucky dude. You know, he was in TV and football and fucking. And that's it. And I was into it for a while. I was really into it. And I thought my thinking on the, on the matter was, I'm a complicated lady. I'm into esoteric shit. I do a lot of writing, I write auditions, acting, think a lot, brainy. I'll come to him at night and we'll be simple. And we'll, and it'll be good. And it'll be balanced. It'll be balanced in my life. It'll be simple. I'll be complicated. It'll be great. Problem was, that we had no things in common at all. No things in common. So one, one day we had to have the talk and I went, this is 100% true story. I went to him and I said, hey, listen, we got the chemistry. Chemistry, working it, got that. Problem is no things in common. We have no things in common. And I said, so sometimes I honestly, just vulnerably, just being real with you, I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> <laughs> and he looked me in my eyes and with a completely straight face with no irony looked me in my eyes and said well maybe it's cause my dick's so big <laughs> and then he just kept looking at me like that and I kept waiting for him to be like no nah, no I'm just fucking around that's the crazy thing to say but he never did <laughs> he was just like and I was like, I think you're correct. <laughs> so we had to break up. <clears throat> Three years later. 